This morning, the countdown is on for a first of its kind space mission that could one day save the planet. Our mission is to hit an asteroid at 15,000 miles per hour. That's tough. That's hard. NASA and SpaceX working together to launch a rocket in hopes of learning how to knock an asteroid off course before it can threaten Earth. It's just a spacecraft that is going to go and smack an asteroid and see if we can change its trajectory just a little bit. The mission, known as the Double Asteroid Redirection Test, or DART, is set to launch just after midnight from California's Vandenberg Air Force Base, sending an unmanned craft the size of a car into space before slamming it into a rock the size of a football stadium. Experts say despite the size difference, the impact should be enough to alter the asteroid's trajectory. Given enough time, um, you, know, you can do big things with small, with small vehicles. The asteroid, which is about 6 million miles away, poses no threat to the planet, and its predictable orbit around a larger neighboring asteroid makes it the ideal setting for scientists to study the effectiveness of the impact. This is the perfect environment to, to test this methodology. So that small asteroid orbits the larger asteroid every 11 hours and 55 minutes. When we hit the asteroid, um, we expect to change the period of that asteroid by about 10 minutes. The rocket won't reach its destination for at least 10 months, but for now, all focus is on liftoff. Scientists say they have a launch window of only one second. Otherwise, they'll have to wait another 24 hours for the next opportunity. We won't know whether DART's been a success until several years from now when a European space mission will check to see if it worked. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel and don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.